If you were put in a micro- Oh no, no, don't- no. <laughs> That is a horrible idea. The water molecules in your body would heat up because of the radiation- Yeah, that is the correct type of radiation. The microwave radiation interacts with the water molecules in the body heating tissue. At about 2.5 gigahertz, this is going to excite by a dipole rotation, not ionizing radiation. ...beamed at you, your skin would start to burn and blister, and you'd quickly go blind. Okay, this would not happen this quickly for a typical household microwave of about 700 to 1200 watts. However, if you're making one big enough to put a person in at a much higher power output, maybe. That's just horrific, though. Your organs would boil and then break open, causing okay. internal bleeding. And gas pockets in your digestive system would expand. This would require power output comparable to a small nuclear reactor on the order of megawatt for it to be this quick. Microwaves would be hazardous to be inside one, but this would take several minutes. But organ failure, blindness could happen. Till your stomach burst. Within just a few minutes, your body would be destroyed and you'd be cooked for yeah, this whole cooked from the inside out, a bit misleading. This is all from dielectric heating, not ionizations, because microwaves only penetrate to a very limited depth. I know this is clearly dramatized and should never microwave yourself, even if it were possible to make one this big, but this sort of accident is more like a targeted extremely intense heat lamp not a sci-fi disintegrator would require immediate medical intervention but not this fast unless you really cranked up the power somehow